All right, guys, so your grips aren't tacky anymore. So every time when you go to hit the ball, your hands slip a little bit, creating a snap hook or a big slice. We don't want that. We're gonna try rubbing alcohol, see if it gets all that natural oils, the dirt and the grime out of the grip, making it tacky again. Guys, the before and after on this is crazy, so make sure you stay to the end to see that. All you need for today is some rubbing alcohol and a towel. Make sure that the towel doesn't fall apart and ruin the grips. Shout out to my uncle, Uncle Shane, for uh, telling me this trick. I don't know if I'm doing it right. If I'm doing it wrong, it's uh, Uncle Shane's fault. Get a bit of rubbing alcohol on here. He said all you need to do is go ham. Put it on a towel and just go ham. So that's what we're doing. Oh, it looks shiny already. Oh my gosh. Wow. So you can see on the towel just a little bit that I've done that there's already dirt there. That's a good sign. What I was also thinking that you guys could do is put this in a spray bottle. It really shines it up. So you can see the difference. It's much shinier, black. Wow. Look at that. The other great thing about this trick is you can do it with whatever grips you want. So I got a flat golf pride grip like this. I also got the two-tone where it's a little bit rougher. All grips make some more tack here. Looking at the putter grip. You guys can see that there's some dirt on there. It's about a year old, didn't use it too much. Last time I did this, I did it with soap and water. And it actually, uh, it ruined the putter grip because I had the wrong towel and the towel like disintegrated on it. I was on this putter actually, so then I just got a new butter grip. Guys, this, this trick is gonna save you time, gonna save you money. You don't have to go get new grips. <clears throat> oh yeah. They smell nice and clean too now. You can see all the dirt and grime getting onto this towel. That's a good sign. The thing about grips is when you use them, you're hot and sweaty. You just put your tea into the ground, you got some dirt on your hands. And then you go, you grab it, all those oils, dirt, grime from your hands are getting onto your grips. And that builds up over time, making it less sticky, less tacky. But you can see right there, that is much tackier. The one thing I did want to show you guys is a grip like this, where it's all old and disintegrated. I'm going to be honest, just throw that out. You guys don't want to be using a grip like this and uh, rubbing alcohol isn't gonna fix it. I, don't, I think you're gonna need something a little stronger than that, you know? The importance of having a tacky grip, so when you line up, your hands aren't gonna be switching and moving, creating the ball to go somewhere else that you don't want it to. There you guys have it. Just a bit of rubbing alcohol on your clubs. Should do the trick, make them brand new again. Don't tell your buddies though, so then you can be hitting way better than them. See you in the next video. Subscribe, like the video. Peace.